Hey friends, welcome back to the party. It's me, your girl, Britt Reacts, and today we're reacting to Nancy Sinatra. These boots were made for walking. Let's see what she has to say. Bene. Grazie. Grazie. Questo è il periodo dei figli di padri noti. Eh? L'altra volta, vi ricordate, vi abbiamo presentato Emanuele De Sica. Questa volta si tratta della figlia di, di una persona che in questi ultimi anni se, mi sembra che si sia fatta un po' notare appena appena, eh? La ragazza porta il nome di... la ragazza, la signora, porta il nome di Nancy Sinatra! I speak Italian, obviously. I understood everything. I love her little prance! <laughs> Does she speak Italian? Vogliamo dire qualche cosa per l'occasione, per esempio, vogliamo sentire per curiosità, io già lo so, eh, quali sono le origini della famiglia Sinatra, per mm -hmm. favore. My grandfather's from Sicily. Dunque, un nonno siciliano. Mm -hmm. My grandmother's Genovese. Uh, nonna Genovese. And my other grandfather and grandmother are Neapolitan. E gli altri wow. due nonni so napoletani. Quindi non si dica che qui abbiamo cantanti stranieri. Full eh, Italian? Italiani. Completamente italiani, tanto vero che la signora parla perfettamente l'italiano. Vuol dirci qualche cosa in italiano per cortesia? Oh, sì, sì. Uh, ciao. Sì? No, no, ma dico avanti. Uh, grazie. Sì. Ciao, grazie. <coughs> Senz'altro. Senta, vuol dire... Is that all she knows in Italian? Me too, girl. Stasera. These boots are made for walking. Che vuol dire, questi stivaletti sono fatti per camminare. Una canzone che hanno fatta in occasione del famoso sciopero dei, dei, dei trasporti, no, mi pare, a New York e che ha avuto veramente un successo mondiale. In questo momento il massimo hit americano e un grande successo in tutto il mondo. Allora, buona canzone. Grazie. Oh. Grazie. Ciao. Um. Okay, y'all know I love an interview before or after a song, and though I didn't understand what he was saying, you, you can gather and grasp. Uh, we learned that I'm assuming all of those maybe regions or areas or whatever are all Italian, meaning the Sinatra family is Italian fully, or at least she is. Um, I found out just a couple days ago that Nancy Sinatra was Frank Sinatra's daughter. I didn't even know, like, of Nancy Sinatra. Angelina Jordan sang her song Bang Bang, which I didn't know was her song. Uh, and in the title of that video, it said Nancy Sinatra cover. And I was like, hmm, wait, Sinatra as in the Frank Sinatra? And y'all let me know. Yeah, hello, he has a daughter. And she sings, these boots are made for walking. Yeah, I got to listen to it. And I'm excited because this, this looks like the 60s. Her hair is fantastic. I love the outfit. Let's go. You keep saying you got something for me. Hazelwood Lee. Something you call love, but confess. Huh, you've been huh. messing where you shouldn't been a messing. Ooh. Now someone else is getting all your best. Ooh, I don't, I've never listened to the words of this song. I think I was introduced to this song because of Austin Powers. I feel like I can confidently say that. You know, the scene with the girls who are dressed in like the 60s mod outfits and the guns come out of their bras. And I'm pretty sure this song is playing. Like if memory serves me right, I'm pretty sure this song is playing. Also, as the performer of this song, you always have to wear boots when you sing it, don't you? Like you always have to have on some form of a boot or it just doesn't make sense. Um, yeah, but I never realized this song is about like a guy who like messed up. And so she walked out. You would think one would assume, but I had no idea. I like it. And now someone else is getting all your best. These boots are made for walking. And that's just what they'll do. One of these days, these boots are gonna walk all over you. Yeah. I also think, sorry, just all the things. I also think 
in my mind, I always imagine this song, and this is just one performance out of, I'm sure, a million. That, But I always thought this song was performed in a, like, stealthy, spy, sassy way. And she's almost got this, like, quiet feminine power about her. Like, it's not super aggressive or she's not doing too much. She's simply, you know, walk all over you. Kind of reminds me of uh, Patsy Cline's Crazy. You know what I mean? Where she was singing and the eyes were giving you crazy, but she was very gentle and, and soft. <laughs> kind of reminds me of that. Yeah. You keep lying when you ought to be truthful. You better stop lying. You better be truthful. <laughs> when you ought to not bet. You better not even try to bet. I love this. You keep saying when you ought to be changing. This is, it's cute. It's clever. Saying when you ought to be a changing. Now what's right is right. But you ain't been right yet. <laughs> My boots are made for walking. walking. And that's just what they'll do. One of these days, these boots are gonna walk all over you. I feel like that everyone, man, woman alike, should should operate in this way. Like the minute you don't get it right, I'm out the door. All right, I've given you chances. If you just keep doing the same old, the saming is saming and it ain't changing. Do you know what I mean? The lying is lying and it ain't truthing. I gotta go. Uh, these boots were made for walking. And it's just, it's as simple as that. I'm just saying. You didn't buy the boots to sit. You bought them to walk. This little toe step is so cute. You keep playing where you shouldn't be playing. Who are these men sitting behind her? So and you keep thinking that you'll never still. get burned. Ha! Ha! I just found me a brand new box of matches. Oh. And what he knows you ain't had time to learn. Oh. Walking, and that's just what we'll do. One of these days, these boots are gonna walk all over you. Are you ready, boots? Hmm? <laughs> See, you have to, you have to wear boots if you're gonna refer to them. Are you ready boots and you have on kitten heels? Are you ready boots and you have on sneakers? Are you ready boots and you have on ballet flats? You got to wear boots. You ha she has to wear boots. She had to wear boots every time she performed this. Every single time. It was that simple. The I love her little It's such a like little girl wave. Huh, that was interesting. What was most interesting to me is like the guys, the, well, I assume they're men, but all the people sitting behind her like not even moving. It felt like a judge's panel or something. Um, she was really darling, just darling. The song, I like I said, I never listened to the lyrics and now I love it even more. Um, let me know if I'm right about Austin Powers. I'm pretty sure. Uh, and I feel like it's probably been featured in many other movies I just don't know or maybe don't remember. I'm excited to read your comments. Have the day you deserve. Bye.